Bonjour tout le monde, je m'appelle Claire et je parle français parce que je suis une étudiante à l'université où j'étudie le français. Um, I know that maybe you didn't understand that and that's okay. That was some more advanced French, but I'm back with a Grover and this Grover is going to teach you how to say some basic French phrases. So first up, we're going to go with the basics, the most basic word of all, which is hello. And in French, hello is Bonjour. So the word is bonjour. Try to say it. And it's a little hard because when you at the end of bonjour, you kind of have to make a sound in the back of your throat. But if you can't get it right now, that's okay because that's a skill that takes a long time to learn. The second word that we're going to learn is a more form or a more informal version of hello. So bonjour is often used for more formal settings. Maybe you're saying hello to a teacher or a stranger. Um, but if you're going to just be saying hi to your friends, you can say this word, which is salut. And this can be used as a casual greeting for both hello, and it can also be used as like, so it's like hey, or you can use it as like bye. There's a different word for goodbye, but if you're just saying goodbye to like your pals, you can also say salut. So why don't you try? Good job. And the next word we are going to be learning how to say is how are you? And there are two ways of saying how are you, again, depending on if you're trying to be more formal or not. So if you're trying to be more formal, the way you are going to want to say that is by saying, comment ça va? Why don't you try? Again, it's comment ça va? The little C with the squiggly tail underneath it makes it have an S sound. So comment ça va? But you can also say to your friends, just Ça va. And then the responses to these, there are three that are the main three responses. If you want to say, I'm doing well, you're saying, ça va bien. Why don't you try? If you want to say, I'm doing badly or it's not going great, you would say, ça va mal. Again, it's ça va mal. Why don't you try? And then if you want to say, eh, it's going okay, this is a really fun one, you can say, ça va comme si comme ça. So again, it's ça va comme si comme ça. And that just kind of means, eh, it's going okay. And all of these are um, going to be the responses for both comment ça va and just ça va. So if you are first meeting somebody for the first time, you may say, bonjour, comment ça va? And they will say, ça va bien. And then if they ask you your name, you would respond with, je m'appelle your name. So for me, I would say, je m'appelle Claire. Or if your name is Alex, je m'appelle Alex. Um, that's how you say my name is. So why don't you try that with your name? And then one of the other important facts that we like to talk about when we're introducing ourselves is where are we from? So to say where are we from, where you are from, you're going to say, je viens de Minneapolis. For example, for me, je viens de Minneapolis. But maybe you're from Brainerd, je viens de Brainerd, je viens de Minnesota, uh, je viens de Wisconsin. You can use all different places, je viens de uh, New York City. Um, of course, there are some different words for other countries um, in French. So. Uh, the English translation, um, or just like the English word for, for countries might not work, um, but they'll probably still get the gist of what you're saying. So if you want to say, I'm from the United States, I don't have this written out, but you would say, je viens des États-Unis. Um, de, uh, des États-Unis is the United States. Um, so, je viens de des, uh, de, de, des États-Unis, sorry. Je viens des États-Unis, and then je viens de Minneapolis. And then um, the word for thank you is merci. And the, this gets a little tricky because just like at the end of bonjour, you kind of have to do that thing in the back of your throat. But the good thing about bonjour is you can kind of just say bonjour and it kind of works. But um, the funky R sound in this word is in the middle. So it kind of gets a little difficult. And if you can't do it right away, that's totally okay. It took me years to learn how to do it. Um, but maybe you can because some people just can 
can do that. And that's super cool. Um, but again, the word is merci. So why don't you try that? Perfect. And um, the way to say formal goodbye, this also has a kind of complicated R sound, is au revoir. So when you first look at it, it kind of looks like you would say au revoir, but it kind of blurs into one word. So it's kind of au revoir, au revoir. And that's how you would say a more formal goodbye. So how would you say how you would say goodbye to your teachers or um, strangers or people of like that you consider authority figures or like that you look up to and respect. So again, that's au revoir. Why don't you try? Perfect. Again, if you want to say goodbye more casually, just to a pal, you can just say salut. And we oui, say say tu, say la fin. Um, that's the end. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any phrases that you want to learn in French, feel free to comment them down below and I'll make another Grover making, um, just teaching you how to say those phrases. So yeah, bye everybody.